Good morning, welcome to another video. So today, um, we're going to be putting a new pair of seats in the E36. Warren's bought a set of these uh, by Marco Cobra 2s. They seem really good value for money. Decent quality. The reason we're doing it is, let me assume this seat a minute. That's it, it won't stay up. We did that at the last track day. So yeah, we're going to take that out and see, uh, see how we go. You want to vacuum your back out, mate? <laughs> Fucking vile. Oh, but it's foam from the seat, man. Oh yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> the seat's just fucked, isn't it? That's a fucking state warrant. Anyway, yeah, so um, we were hoping these would just bolt bolt straight in. Um, obviously, I have to open that out a little bit. Um, but they're slightly short on the back hole. Um, so what I'm probably going to do, I'm going to see what I've got in the shed, and we'll probably just weld a tab onto the back of there. Um, so then we can just bolt it straight in. And they bolt in pretty well. Um, that one we had to flip around, um, so it's that way. But that actually works out better. Because with them both like that, the seat sits in, and in the E36 the seats are slightly offset to the centre console anyway. Um, so the seat will sit pretty much perfectly there. So basically all we've got to do is, like I said, weld a little tab just onto the end of there so it can pick up on that. Bolt them in, and there we go. Obviously we've got to work out how we're going to bolt the uh, seat belt um, to the seat as well. That should just pick up on the side of the seat actually where it, where it bolts. It's on that one there, because on the original seat. I hate that pretension. Yeah, you got the pretension there. We just cut the wire for that. Um, I'm well saying that the, the whole bracket might not like go on with pretensioner, but we'll have we'll have a look. But that shouldn't be too hard. Thanks, I did that. What I'm going to do? I'm just going to cut this this tab off um, off the standard rail, um, slice that straight off. I'm hoping I'll be able to weld that to the end of the bracket, um, and it'll pick pick straight up. Um, yeah. Good luck, guys. Looks like we've welded the uh, those tabs on like that. Just gonna give them a bit of a clean up. I've got a. Uh, open those holes out a little bit and slot that one in a little bit. Um, yeah, I'm going to spray out the welds, clean it all up a little bit and should bolt straight in. So that one in. Do one on that side now. So the bracket's bolted in. Okay, we had to f move the brackets around because the seat was a little bit too far forward so uh, we switched the ones from that side onto this side. Um, the seat's tiny little bit more forward than we want but it ain't too bad um so yeah that's passenger one in it's in there solid seat belt mounting um so yeah we're just gonna do the same thing on the driver's side now so that's them all installed now it's probably forward a little bit more than we'd like but it ain't too bad i'm um, warranted to have a go in it so volume is it's not too bad at all i mean worst case scenario we could always get a flatter steering well it's not dished but i don't know it's not bad anyway it's all right so yeah, that's that done. So yeah, that's that all done now. Uh, you know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe. And uh, I'll see you next time.